Hello Malcolm, and hello everyone else. Welcome to episode 25 of the Abyss. Well, we're down in the prisons on level 7. <laughs> and my dog has just taken yet another sock off to yet another bed. Did I mention to you guys... I have to turn down this music. Oh my god. I hope it's not too loud for you. It's great music, but really. Did I mention to you that my dog considers socks to be puppies? He, uh... Quite a while ago, my neighbor's dog had puppies. And as soon as my big, rescued brood of a dog heard the puppies, he started carrying socks around the house and tucking them into bed and kissing them and licking them and just making sure they were safe all the time. And now he's got this sock there's probably 40 socks in his bed, and I cleaned it out of socks like a week ago. He will take any sock. He prefers a dirty sock that you've been using. But if he's really hard up, he'll take a clean one. Okay, so this guy has just showed us the secret exit that he dug using his belt buckle. Um, if we had a rock pick or something, we'd get rid of that boulder, but... Looks like we're in a new area here that goes off quite extensively. Uh, yeah, the music is quite something. I'm wondering if we can do that jump with just a run. Like, maybe we can sprint to that. We're just going to save game and try it. Yeah, yeah, we were able to. Oh, is this going to be another one we can't open? We don't have the keys or the lock picking skill for this. Key does not fit. We've got one other key. Key does not fit. We'll try the lock pick a few times, but it's going to be just like these other ones in here. We can't open them. And we can't break that kind of door. I wonder what's down on the floor, because we're probably about to find out. What just happened? I don't know what just happened there, but I'm willing to take it. I'm willing to take it. So, ah. <laughs> uh, now we've got this. We're in pretty good shape hit point wise. Oh man, I can't believe we're making these jumps. So, what's down below? Lava. So let's have a very good look around here. There's more lava. Oh no, that's not lava down there. That's like corridor down there. Okay. Uh, this game does have the ability to make you nervous. Okay, we're going to put away the jail key because uh, I think we've used up its current utility. Uh, the same goes for the medallion. Um, crystal splinter, we don't know what it does. Slightly worn wand of unknown function. Now, despite the fact that we can get stuff identified by a mage on the level above us, I am still inclined to shoot for more lore skill. Okay, so this is going to be basically one heck of a jump, and we are going to save Scummit. We're going to go ahead and save Scummit, so we're going to take this at a run. We made it. Okay. Let's have a look around the area. There's some stairs down. Looks like there's some more jumping irritations ahead of us. But we have the Ring of Leaping plus massive acrobatic skill. So let's just uh, see what we can do. Whoops. Ah, uh, we're down. Ah, uh, we'll try safe scumming at once. Or twice. And see if we can do it. And after that, we'll give it up, I guess. Let's just see. Let's try it without the Ring of Leaping. Okay. So having that off was the bonus right there. Uh, now this is going to prove very tricky. Got it. We're going to save game right here. So that went well. So taking off the ring of leaping. That was the key. 
key to that little difficulty. Uh, I hear something. I hear something moving. I don't know what it is. It sounds like it could be a spider. I'm just examining these walls. Close them. We've got a doorway, got a tapestry. We've got a door that's open. Not going through that yet. Um, or maybe we are because it's like the closest target. This is crazy. Don't shut. Don't shut. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It's the secret door area we were at before. Okay. So, we're facing east. Yes, it's unexplored, and so is the lava up there where we were doing the jumping puzzle, and so is part of that. Oh, do we have to go back west to do that now? Well, no, because we're going to have to come back there to do those doors. We currently have no way to open those doors. Oh, man, I don't know where my abyss sheet is. Um, if we do find an onk, I'll get out my abyss sheet and... Uh, We'll try to get some lockpicking skill. Other than that, yeah, I guess we're going to adventure this way. See what we can do. That all looks extremely dangerous. Oh, really? Okay. An onk. Okay, so I gotta go find my abyss sheet. Let's have a little quick look around this neighborhood. I heard monsters moving, you know, like it wouldn't be wise to, yeah, for example, neglect that. Try to mash him. He's a really tough rat. I guess these are uh, tougher levels. Okay, we're gonna have a look around the Ankh area. Gotta put the sword away to examine, so. Just gonna take a look around. Okay, like a caved in wall here. Oh, we've got that ring on. Caved in passageway, yeah. Stuff. This is just a blank corner. But this goes down. There's another caved-in passageway, and this goes down. Okay, we're gonna look around. We've got a bag. Oh no, we've got a serious problem. We've got a, like, dark troll. Uh, he just smackified us super bad, like, super bad. We should maybe be using the jeweled sort of additional damage on this character. He's gonna wreck our shirt. I don't know if we can actually kill him. I think he might kill us. I think we might end up silver treated back to shacks. I don't want to. I want to win this. I don't want to lose this. I don't even know where we last saved. I want this guy dead, and I want him dead now. But he's making just a wreck of It's pretty close match. He's uh, he's as tough as we are, basically. Uh, maybe he's tougher. Come on, go down. Oh no 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 no! Oh, I'm cursing my luck. I'm so angry. <sighs> so we do. Do we take our losses and repair to shacks? Or do we reload? We're reloading. We're getting out the jeweled sort of additional damage. Maybe we'll have the other one out in case the jeweled sword gets wrecked. Okay, we're going in, we're doing the same thing. We're doing the same exact thing. We're gonna have a look through here. There's a rat that comes up on us. I know, it's safe scumming. This is purest safe scumming, and it'll serve me right if I lose and die as a result. 
but I don't want that troll to get away with his nonsense. So we went in here and he came, basically. Yeah. And then he'll show up. Yeah. Ah, uh, we're gonna lose again. He's too tough. The jeweled sword is a superior weapon, that's for sure. Oh yeah. It is. And we should have been using it to start with, and I'm sorry guys, if this results in our death again, I will give up and go back to Shax. I just don't want to. Oh no. He's so harsh. I don't even know what kind of troll he is. He's like a great troll. Okay, we did him in. I cheated. Well, you can call it cheating. You can call it what you want to. Serviceable jeweled sword. We're putting that away and getting this one out again. And we're going to put that away and we're going to save our game. That was a very rough encounter. A very bad time. The avatar did not have all over a sack, eh? Let's have a look in the sack. Oh, a skull, a pile of bones, and a perfect crown. Well, let's throw away the skull and the pile of bones in the sack. Perfect crown. We cannot identify it, or it might be nothing. Let's put it in the treasure thing. Uh, wherever treasure's kept these days. Ah, uh, we'll just put it in this bag. See if we can eat our meat. Too full to eat that now. You're full and wide awake. Uh, we do need a rest. Eleven coins left by that awful bloody troll. We can leave our light on while we sleep. We've got a never-ending light, so we can leave it on while we sleep. Hope we don't get a dream. No dream. We feel rested. Okay, we're going to continue on our way here. Uh, we should be going back to the Ankh, really, but we're so currently committed to exploring this area. Stairs down. So that's two sets of stairs down. And I'm going to say that we take these ones. We're on level 8. We're on level 8. We have no idea what's going on. Uh, we have minimum mana right now. But it is refilling. Uh, what? You're dead. Just don't have time for it. Pesky imps. He was probably mellow, but I really like there's no time for that right now. We're in serious trouble. You know, I'm almost tempted to make a run for Shax and try to get our jeweled sword repaired. I don't want to go there by dying. I feel that's crazy. An orb rock. I guess we'd better have one of those just to see what they do. Have an orb rock. They're everywhere. Orb rock. Oh my god, what? Okay, attack. Oh man, no. I forgot how tough they were. The poking. The poking of the Jedi. Come on, the slicing of the giant eye. The poking and the slicing of the giant eye. Uh, luckily it doesn't seem the spider's jumping us, so that's a bit of a lucky thing. Uh, I'm saying we get out of here. This is really heavy. But let's have a look at what's here. Now, we're really short on carry space, so... An excellent long sword. Let's see if it's magical. It might be too heavy. Come on. No. An excellent long sword. 
Well, I don't see any reason to take it. Ours is still excellent. Badly worn breastplate. You know, even if it's magic, we can't really do it. Let's just have a quick look around here. Upset wolf spider. I think we're gonna go. I think we're gonna go. I think we're gonna go. Back up. There goes our magic. Oh, I guess what we should do is go back down and try to cast in Manny. Oh, and then we're gonna game scum it. Yeah. Perfect. That's something to know, eh? That's nice. So we've got full hit points, 87 out of 87. Uh, I'm gonna say we make a shack run. We're gonna try to get up there alive. I know, I'm a big save scumming save scummer. I'm a little... this is a bit much, so... Wow, getting out of here is crazy. Uh, well, it's not that crazy. We head west and then south, so let's... We could keep exploring, but we're down to two carrying. Our sword is damaged. We could keep exploring. Let's keep exploring. So, let's go south and east. And just keep looking around. Oh, there's an Ankh, too. Right, we can meditate. Well, let's have a bit further. You know, we should have labeled that Ankh, right? Uh, where is it? Is it here? We'll just try to remember, but we should have. Because that's kind of a landmark. Okay, okay. This doesn't look safe. Oh, look, what's this? We've got our ring of leaping. Can we do it? Oh, look what the, There's a thing and there's a whole area. Oh, my God. Oh, it makes you crazy, eh? Almost do it, eh? I'm gonna try a few times. Uh, I'm gonna be here for a second because this isn't. Oh my god, we got it. We got it. We're up here. We are up and we're gonna grab the ragged scroll. A ragged magical scroll. So into the scroll case to be later identified, one hopes. This is pretty neat. Okay, I have no idea what's going on here. I'm gonna save game here. Let's hope we can get back out of this. We can't seem to pass beyond this grating, so let's just head back down. That was amazing and cool. Okay, we're gonna... Oh, it seems like we got stuck on something. That was weird. It's like a glue wall. Yeah, we'll find our way back to that Ankh. I don't know. There's where we killed the troll. Oh, so this area isn't hugely extensive. It's just somewhat extensive. Okay, okay. Right down here. Uh, I guess I should quickly look for secret doors. I don't see any. So back here is the arm. Uh, what was that? I thought I saw something. I don't know what is making that noise. So we got an arm. Uh, we can meditate. I don't know what to meditate on yet. I'm gonna save game in two slots and we're gonna really try to make a shack run right now. We're gonna try to get it there alive. Let's save in all four. We're gonna try to get the shacks alive. This this place is a bit harsh. So we need to go west, south, west, south, west across the bridge anyway. Here, 
And then this isn't openable, is it? Oh yes, this leads us back to the secret door area. Oh, this might be quite a quick route through, yeah. So we head south, and there, you know, there could be secret doors here that we've missed, eh? But it looks like we head south from here. Oh. Might not be possible. Uh, let's try our keys that we have. Nice. Okay, that is really handy. So we go south here. Uh, yeah, so. And we're going to check for secret doors. Check there, so we go west and south a little. Oh gosh. Here. There is a high pitched keening noise as the rocks part. What? There's a new passage to the south. It must be that crystal. Crystals make keening noises, right? Okay, this is what? You hear rocks falling behind you. Oh, I think we can get over that with a little acrobatics, most likely. Maybe not. Uh, we might be able to break it with our fist or something like that. Well, let's just save game slot one. Open this door. Oh. What is this? An unblemished emerald. Whoop. Thulsun the Mad, survivor of the Third Age. Oh, these are gravestones. Valk. You see a skull. Let's check it for a name. Yeah, let's put it back where we found it. So we could rob those tombstones. Oh, and there is a thing with four emeralds to get the vast rune, right? Thost the Fit. Where the heck? Wait, a secret door. Okay. We're just, we're like, totally, I have no idea what's going on right now. I'm just going ahead with it. <laughs> this leadeth here. We're going to save game slot one. I wanted to do a shack run. I don't want to be here. This is terrifying. Oh, a deeper tomb. How did it then? A secret door. Oh, come on, man. That was obvious. Now more act. That's a cool name. That's unpronounceable. I don't see any secret doors there. Okay, so it wasn't completely obvious. They had two empty teams. Dreadman. Dreadman. We're going to pop this open. We're saving game in slot one. This is nuts. Okay, and this leads down to what is this? I hear an animal. Oh, what's that thing? Oh, can you, did you guys just see what I saw? Like, look, what's this? An excellent black sword. What? Um, yeah. A quiver. Let's look in it. It's got 19 arrows, and they're probably magic. Nice. A serviceable small shield. We'll just chuck that over here for now. Don't even care if it's magical. This is so amazing. A slightly worn wand. A wand of fireball with eight full charges. So, uh... Actually, we'll just keep that out. That's kind of nice. This is... Oh, I wonder if this is magical armor. A broken sword. 
an undamaged gold chain we're just gonna check that out an undamaged gold chain we're so low on carry right now a serviceable tower shield too heavy for us excellent plate leggings too heavy for us we're gonna take off our backpack and examine the leggings and stuff just right now excellent plate leggings so that's nice and all but you know yeah what about this helm an excellent magical helmet okay we're keeping that we're down to zero carry space so we're gonna have to really think some things over the excellent long swords come out mm-hmm that piece of meat tasted kind of bland. That's gone. We're satiated and wide awake. Sweet. Okay. Um, what else? Well, we've got a bunch of jams. Get rid of some of them. I don't know if they're as useful to trade as gold, but they're lighter than gold. But I think we need some gold just for trade, you know. Let's drop ten of our gold pieces. I don't dare carry less, I think. So that gave us another one. Okay, this is most entertaining. I love that we got a magic helmet. Let's put that to one side. See if we can pick up the black sword. You see an excellent black sword of great accuracy. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think we have our new weapon on our hands. As soon as it becomes even slightly damaged, we shall swap it out. Uh, this was a most unanticipated haul of treasure. That was amazing. I need to get out of here. Like, I like it here. Don't get me wrong. These are nice tombs, and I'm enjoying my visit. But I'm getting a little freaked out and I want to go up to Shaxx, maybe catch a fish or two on the way, and get the hell out of this terrifying mausoleum of death. Uh, how do we get out? Okay, we are unexplored to the south, so we want to go north and west right now. We want out of here. I, I've had enough. We've got to get past this. Um, let's take our sword off. Get our hand out. Drop down and let's... Let's beat this boulder to pieces. Do you think we can actually do this? I won't spend an overlong time on the experiment. I'm just wondering if it is possible for us to do this or if we're stuck in the tombs now and we have to find the way out some other way. Uh, I'm getting the feeling you can't do this. Yeah, I'm getting the feeling you can't do this. So. We're going to take off our ring of hopsing and jumpsing, and we're just going to try to get over this with normal acrobatics. I think we're stuck, guys. I think we're stuck in here. Shack run impossible without one of the mining hammers, which I don't believe we hauled because we're desperate to save weight. Yeah, I do not think we're getting out of here. Uh, we'll put the ring back on and try again. Give us more powerful leaps. Now, okay, we got to find our way out through these damn tombs. We're totally hosed. And it's unexplored to the south, so it's south. We're going, lads and lassies. Uh, uh, there's nothing there. Okay. There's nothing to the south. We're opening this up. Nordak. Okay, they're not making with the obvious secret doors anymore. Oh, I hope we can find a way out of this place, guys. There might not be one. Oh, there's another secret door. Got one. Got one. 
Well, let's hope this leads to some sort of way out of here. I mean, what a wonderful treasure hall, but without a mining hammer we can't get out? Maybe that wand of fireball would blast the rock apart. Yikes. Okay, we're gonna try our sword. It's mighty accurate. Now, it's smashing on him. And it's not getting damaged yet. We gotta watch that we don't hit the wall with it and stuff. This specter seems quite tough, or else this sword is quite low-powered. Could be that the sword's low powered. We were using jeweled additional damage a minute ago. That is kind of scary. That did the job. We'll put away the black sword. I love it. Uh, we found a secret door right there. So we are going to get out of here somehow. It's just going to take a little doing. I have no idea where we are, folks. Okay, we're into a built area again. Oh, we're into an area we've been in, oddly enough. I uh, don't get that. We're going to head southeast. Okay. Oops, banged into the wall. Ah, uh, you see an upset guard. Well, I think we're going to talk to him. And then we're probably going to kill him. Show medallion to pass. And I can say, ha, I go where I want with or without any medallion, or two, here it is. Well, I'm going to keep being my tricky self and show him the medallion. Here it is. Okay, go through door to south his way. Go now. Close up our box with our medallion. Thank you, kind goblin. Whoa, he's gone. Um, that's odd. Okay, they're all here. Okay, we're in, obviously, yet another... Oh, okay, so hang on. Let's go back northwest. And here is the bridge to the other area that gets us out of here. So I think we're going to cross that bridge right now and get out of here. Yeah, this should take us to the stairs up in a reasonable order here. And we're going to we're going to basically flee. It may take us a little while to do the fleeing. We've got to find the closest upstairs to here. Um so we got to go down there so southeast north east. North, east, north. Then I, yeah, I go north a ways and cut east. Kind of following the contours of the place, like so. And here I go. Like, oh, whoa, don't fall in the things. Gotta go over this way. That's not bad. Uh, is this the stairs? I think it is. Yep. So that's not bad at all. It's Shakron, folks. It's Shakron time. We ditched one of our swords. We're oh, we could get that magician to identify a bunch of junk for us. Oh, we really could. Which is the guy that identifies stuff? I think it's Dominus. Number two. We only have 21 gold, though. <sighs> so do we just meditate for more lore? And do our own? Identify? Oh, that is a tough one, because I'm tempted to meditate for more picklock, too. Let's go spend what gold we have on identifying, and then we'll pick up more gold at shacks. And take it down with us, or whatever. We'll pick up some gold along the way. It's probably not that hard to get gold. I just, I, I kind of want to have some with us. In case there's a place where we have to really bargain. 
and you know, like some people don't talk anything but money, right? I think this is the way to Dominus here. Yeah, it's Dominus. Um, so what do we want to identify? Nah. Oh, this helmet. Yeah, the helmet. Ten gold pieces, so wherever our treasure sack is at this point in time. Uh, I know we have some. Let's give him all eleven. Get it out of the inventory, whatever. Here thou art. That is a helmet of magic lantern. Will there be anything else? Oh, that's so cool, you guys. I have know that is all because we're out of money. And I don't know where to trade for money down here. Okay, so we're going to pull off our crown. We're going to throw on our helmet. And we're going to turn off our... Look at that! We've got, like, fabulous light. Better than the uh, taper. Okay, well that works well because this is armor and we can... Uh, <laughs> losing my way. Not only is it armor, we can uh, get light from it. So we're going to get rid of the taper. Because I'm sure there's going to come a time when we're going to have to put all eight of those damn items in a bag and do something with them. Okay, the best place to go up from here. Oh my god, it's north, isn't it? Yep. Oh, I meant to hit jump. Sorry, I hit space bar. You have to actually use the mouse and the movement system to jump in this. Uh, there's stairs in both of these rooms, I believe. Oh, this helmet's wonderful. We've got great light. Totally saving game. Oh, that's awesome. That was well worth the ten gold pieces. Uh, okay. We need some stairs up from here, so... Uh, looks like the only ones we know of are down here, so... Yeah. Come on, Mr. Spider, move along. Head this way. Check our map. Why does it say fly in there? I don't know. Uh, and there's a door that's not explored. What? I didn't realize that. That's that room with the skeletons where you have to hurt poor. I didn't realize there was an unexplored door in there. Um, I guess we have the power for one herpor. So we'll save game. We're going to go down in here and we're going to check and see if there's a secret door right here. Oh, look at this. Oh, it's an exit. Oh, there was that. It was just a safe way out of that room. That's really cool. So, if you'd been on your game, you could have found that out. So, we keep heading south for a ways. This isn't too bad. I think it gets more complicated on the next level up. Whoops, is this the right way? I think it is. I think this is the right way. Let's just be sure here. Yep. Yeah, I think it's more difficult on the next level. I'm not too sure, I can't remember. Well, on this one you just do a hard speed run west. Ah, oh, this is nice and easy. I'm glad. Uh, I was in the mood for some adventure tonight, but uh, I can tell you I didn't want to get challenged too, too hard. And uh, I found today's little adventure. Let's eat some plants. Although you have to eat around the thorny flowers, the plant is quite good. And let's eat this other one. 
too full to eat it. We'll throw it away. You can run. That's a shame to waste it because stuff doesn't regenerate a lot down here. Okay, so we're on the Mountain King Hall level. Uh, we could trade some stuff for some gold on our way to shacks. Let's do that. I wish to barter with thee. Oh, uh, nope. Farewell. One of these guys will have some gold to barter, so... And Shaq probably has some gold to barter, so... We'll just check it out. No, not any further. Darn it! Oh, we might want to get a piece of food from one of these guys, actually. Uh, that's true. We might want to barter up a piece of food. Okay, he's got seven gold, so we'll try to barter one of our gems for that money. Uh, let's take these two small gems and offer him that for the seven gold. I make thee this offer. Uh, nothing seemed to happen. That's really strange. I'm gonna just try it again. Something's wrong here. Uh, okay, I'm gonna take my stuff out and say I don't want to barter any further. There's something gone wrong there. Let's see if it works with someone else. Uh, I, I hope we don't have like a major bug or something. Uh, let's try this guy. Barter with thee. So we'll try to barter with him for some food for these one of these red champs for a stick of food. I make you this offer. I accept your offer. Well, I guess that wasn't a very good deal for us. Ah, uh, we got a stick of food. The old piece of meat. Okay, and bartering's working again, so we're gonna try some more bartering. We're actually gonna try it with the same guy. No gold, so... Farewell, and we'll just try one more. We, we would like to barter up some gold. I really would like to barter up some gold. I don't know why that didn't work with the other guy. He's got six gold. Let's try one of our small gems for six gold. That actually sounds pretty fair, so I'll make you this offer. No, I do not like this deal. Okay, let's offer him one of our large gems for six gold. I'll make you this offer. No, I do not like this deal. Okay, we'll offer him these two gems. He's a pig. He accepts our offer. We're taking the gold. That was a rip. Talk about scrounging for money. I wonder how much we've got left at Shaq's and how much better of a deal Shaq will give us. That's why you gotta have the appraised skill, eh? Alright, let's head to Shaq's. I know Shaq has some gold in his uh, possession because we've given it to him and very intelligently, the game remembers exactly what uh, you've traded, and then the person has a chance to offer that item in trade. So there's still some gold left at Shacks because we've been spending gold at Shacks. I think there might be still be some gold on the ground too. I'm certainly not willing to blow any more gems like that. Yeah, there's still some heaps of gold on the ground, so we'll consolidate one maybe. Here's four coins. Let's throw that on there. 10. Uh, we got 67 coins. We'll leave that. Uh, let's see how many this is. 11 coins. Too heavy. And back here we got a little pile of coins. So can't see it. 23 coins. We got a ton of money here. We got a ton of money here. So uh, we can't eat our meat just yet. Um, we are going to try to repair everything that we can on the anvil. Oh, we could go pray for more repair skill. Let's see if it allows us to repair the black sword of ultimateness. You cannot repair that, so I don't think any amount of repair skill is going to help us with that. So we're gonna we're gonna keep our hat on about what to meditate on because we've got a lot of options. We've made a real mess out of Shaq's room again. I'm sorry about that, but. We'll just clear out the bedding area a bit. Oh, see, this is our sack that we uh, have our items in, so...
put down our backpack, pick up our sack with the items here. Ah, 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 ah. Ha. Come on. It's still too heavy? Are you kidding me? Okay, we'll put down our box too. Okay, we got the sack. And that's got the items. We're going to throw the taper in there. And do we have any other ones? Uh, did we win any other items? Well, I'm damned if I know. Oh, darn it. Oh, I just... Well, we'll find out when we go through our inventory. So there's the sack with the eight items that I just casually hooked. There's our pack back. There's our box back. We need those things. We probably want this flute. It's too heavy for us. The flute's too heavy. <sighs> Wand of fireball with eight full. Oh, we got so much stuff here. So much stuff. Well, right. What was I saying? Yeah, we're going to try to repair as much of our stuff as we can because uh, our buckler, I know, was damaged. So we're going to save in a bunch of slots here. Our buckler was damaged. Who knows what else is damaged? Let's try our repair skill out. See how we do. Use anvil on one. We'll start with the helmet. Hard to repair the helmet. We will try it. damaged the helmet. Restore game one. Shaq's fixing the helmet. Try the anvil. Hard to repair the male shirt. No. It would be nice to be able to fix this stuff, wouldn't it? I mean, we could go chant for repair skill. Mm. I think there might be a limited amount of experience you're able to get. Our experience is 98.88. I wouldn't be surprised if that maxed at 99.99, so we're actually not going to go for more repair skill. We're just going to repair what we can here. Seems almost pointless, but it's fun. So simple to repair the leather gloves. Fully repaired the leather gloves. Wish we had better leggings. Simple to repair the leather leggings. Really wish we had better leggings. And uh, I don't think we can fix our crown or anything. Cannot repair that. So that's a crown of great protection, but you know, I'm going to take off our backpack again and our box again, and I'm going to just grab a bag here. Oh my god, it's just packed with what? Oh my god. This is packed. Oh, we're, we're, we have like massive wealth packed away. Okay, we're going to throw the crown in that sack of wealth. And now I don't know which box is the right one or anything. So let's grab our pack and let's grab that box and hope it's the right one. That box is not the right one. That box is the right one. Okay. Oh my god. So we don't know what this wand is. It needs identifying. Or Brock, we better keep on us. The crystal splinter, I don't know, it might be done. Or it might not. You know, that might be the only place the rocks part, or it might not be the only place the rocks part. I've got a feeling it's the only place the rocks part. We need some kind of... We're going to grab this coffer. We're going to put the medallion, the crystal splinter, and the unknown wand into the gold coffer. Now we've got a magical red. Restore mana, mana boost, and restore mana. Okay. We've got some keys. We seem to have used them up, but we're not going to get silly about that might still have to use those down on that level, so we're not going to be fools about it. So we're going to take this gold coffer, dump it, close that up. Mm. 
so many... Ah, uh, so many things. Gate travel, reveal, freeze time, telekinesis, LeBlanc, and a ragged, magical, unidentified. Kind of want to keep all that stuff. Um, jeweled sort of additional. Do we keep it? You know, there's the tough part. We're keeping our fishing pole. You can't have enough. A perfect crown, and we can't identify that either, so... Uh, the gold coffers for an unidentified stuff. Uh, let's grab that crown out. Uh, throw it in the gold coffer, throw it on the gold coffer. <sighs> We're trying to get ourselves a little organized here. We're trying to get ourselves a little organized here. We're carrying some gems. We do have a bit of gold on us just for Shaq right now. It's going to be hard to carry gold with our weight limitations that we've got. Oh, we need to repair our buckler. That was what was the most damaged out of everything. Simple to repair the buckler. So we totally need to get that done. No effect on the buckler. Simple to repair the buckler. Fully repaired the buckler. So we've got an excellent helmet of magic lantern, excellent mail shirt of protection, excellent buckler of great protection, normal leggings, normal gloves, an excellent black sword of great accuracy, and a serviceable jeweled sword of additional damage. So we're going to whip that jeweled sword out. And uh, now we're going to start asking the shack for a little on the helpish side. So, probably going to be leaving you guys here. We don't know... Wow, that helmet, eh? Like, look at that. Look at that. That is fabulous. We have a piece of meat to eat, so we're going to be okay. I love this new helmet, man. It's as bright as a day spell. So awesome. So, yeah, we're going to get Shaq to fix our stuff, all our stuff, and get it all up to snuff. Uh, most of our equipment seems to hold out down there, and there is the occasional anvil in the deeps, but stuff like this sword? Well, let's see. We do have lots of gold here, so... Let's start with the black sword. This is in need of repair. Fourteen pieces of gold to get it fixed up. Yes, please do. Ready for ye in eleven minutes. Don't forget the fourteen gold. Excellent. I shall see thee then. Um, so I'm gonna grab up some more gold. We've got, what? Uh, uh, 10 on us. He wants 14, so we'll grab another 5 to give him a tip. Throw that right in there. We've got 15 gold on us. And then we're going to do the rest of the repairs. Um, and Shaq takes real time, not game time. Well, game time, I guess, is real time. I don't really know. I'm uh, going to try to get the door shut on Shaq's house. Yeah, got the door shut. We could spike it shut if we had spikes. I love that about this game. But we've done what we can with our own equipment. We're going to have our sword and our spare sword fixed up. Um, we still can't identify these nice magical boots, so... Let's put them in the gold coffer of stuff to identify. And when we get more identify skill, we'll grab that gold coffer up and start identifying things in it. Oh, we've got a spare wand somewhere. No pun intended, guys. No pun intended. No, we don't. We don't have a spare wand wandering. Um, so we'll keep that wand of fireball. We'll blast it off at enemies. That's fun. Probably come in pretty handy at some point. Keep it ready. We're not great with missile weapons, but we can do the job. Um, so here we're going to stand for 11 minutes. I'm glad we made it back here live. I know I kind of cheated on one combat, but you know, what are you going to do until tomorrow? So I'm going to save here in four slots right now and bid you guys good day, good night, whatever time it is where you are right now. Hope you're having a good time. We will see you all next time for episode 26. And uh, I'm going to sit here and get Shaq to fix all our stuff. So we'll restart here, but with all our stuff repaired. And we'll go visit the Ankh on this level and do some meditating next, next episode. So until then, bye for now.